Welcome to a Christmas scene. <laughs> Top of the morning to you. Right. Cue the snow. Cue the chill north wind. Ooh, it's now minus five degrees. And here is challenge number three. It's called the game of butt. Now, if someone comes up with a theory, well, someone else has got to come up with a butt. And the first round is between Ace, Cedric, and K9. And this is your question. What makes summer hot and winters cold? Well, as I said, I'm not from this planet, but I reckon the answer is easy. You see, the Earth goes around the sun. So obviously, in the winter, it must be further away. And in the summer, <laughs> it must be closer by. But Cedric is wrong because... But there's always another possibility. Perhaps in the winter, the sun gives out less heat. But Possum, hear me out. In both those cases, the whole Earth would have winter at the same time. But everybody knows that down here in Australia, it's summer when you're in winter. But try and think of something else which makes sunlight feel weaker. This is sunlight in summer. Suppose in winter it's more thinly spread. Diffusion demonstration. Oh, wicked. I can now get a winter's day in Britain, followed by a summer's day in Australia. But how do I get them the other way round? Ah, so near, but you've run out of time. Can you do any better? Here's a clue. Now, Ace said, if only she could turn the earth around. Watch this. And now, time for a commercial break. Super. 